Hello, this is Falco from Ruskiller Business College, and today I will show you how you can use uh, validation controls in Visual Studio 2010. The first thing I will do is to create a new uh, website. I will just call that Validations. After that, I will just add a new form, web form. I will just call that default, default ASP.x. What I'm going to do in this tutorial is to show you how you to use validation control by using a simple validation control in a web application. The first thing I will uh, do is to add an, a text box. After that I will add a enter button and a label. Um, What I'm going to do now is just to add some simple functionality that will change the label text when you press the OK button. What I'm doing here is to set the label text to have a nice day and the text you enter in the text box when someone presses on the OK button. What you can see here is when I enter a name, for example Bob, in the text you can press enter or OK, the label text changes to have a nice day Bob. If I remove the name and press enter, there's just sending have a nice day. But I would like people to enter a name, therefore I will enter, uh, add a validation control to the text box. What I'm going to do now to do now is uh, to add a uh, required field validator. I've just given an ID and then set the control to validate, which is name box. After that, I add an error message. Let's see uh, what happens if we run the application one more time. You can see when I press the OK button without entering a text in the text field, you will get an error message. 
If I now enter a text in the text mark box, you can see the error message disappears and the label text changes. And this was Salco for Roskiller Business College. I hope you enjoyed this day.